So I'm here in my cabin. It's been two months already since I'm on board. My apologies for not uploading a video during that time. I've been very busy, especially during the beginning of my contract. I have not made any videos, I have not edited. And to top it all off, our internet here is very slow. The video that I am actually editing right now is the one you are watching, so I hope you like it. Every time a seafarer goes on board, it's always a different experience. And this would be my sixth contract already as a seafarer. I hope everything goes well, just like my previous contracts. I hope you enjoyed the video, I'll get you into it. From the empty airports of Manila, we arrived safely in Japan where we followed protocols laid out for us. After clearing customs, we waited in hotel for our next swab test, which happened three days after. And when our results all came out negative, we were ready to proceed to Kawasaki port. We just arrived at the port of Kawasaki and we'll be here for a while because we'll be waiting for our service boat which will come here here it is now oh, this is our service boat let's go Another. Take a video when we are we are on deck, so I'll be back when I'm inside the ship. I'm now on board my ship. <sighs> yeah, so this is my new. Uh, this is my temporary cabin. Until the previous intern engineer will disembark, this will be my cabin for now. So I'll take a rest for a while and maybe at yes at, at around six o'clock I'll go down to the engine to check out the engine room and to receive my responsibilities from the outgoing third engineer and then we'll see how it goes from there. Okay, see you then. generator has basically the same function as that of the diesel generator which is to provide power or electricity to the ship. These machineries produce electricity by converting mechanical energy into electrical energy. The only difference is that how does these machineries produce mechanical energy? With the diesel generator, fuel is burned inside the cylinder which then causes combustion energy which makes the piston move upward and downward which then reciprocates to the rotation of the crankshaft and that rotation of the crankshaft produces the mechanical energy to required to be converted into electricity. But for the turbo generator, 
super saturated steam is used to retain the turbine which is then used to provide the said mechanical energy so that's the difference between the turbo generator and the diesel generator so there are some machineries with a little bit of difference with my previous fail cc and that is the economizer the economizer here has a superheater and also connected to it is an lpss which is a low pressure steam separator other than that all machineries are the same the locations are quite different from that of my previous vessel but all are the same so that's it for my video i'm on board again i hope i would have a good contract I'm sorry for the late upload because our internet here is not that good. That's why for some time I'll be uploading some short videos on which I'll be showing some content on both the technical side and the leisure side showcasing the life of a seafarer. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and of course to like and comment and hit the share button. Thank you, thank you. Stay safe and see you in the next one.